Yeah, people calling. Y'all can hear me? Y'all can hear me? Y'all can hear me? Yeah, we got we got to get this under control. We got to get this under control. It's a lot of fakeness going on in the city of New Orleans. You know what I'm saying? I think that y'all can hear me. All right, yeah, you can hear me. Um, it's a lot of fakeness going on in New Orleans. You know what I'm saying? Um, I, it's a lot of fakeness going on in New Orleans, and I think that the people don't want to be exposed of the fakeness that they're doing. So, um, let me add my other page. Make sure y'all follow my other page because them bitches gonna try to take me down. I know they gonna try to take me down because they they hate for the truth to come out. So let me add my other page. Because if they try to take me out, we can still go live. Because ain't no one monkey going to stop this show. See, this is a this is a zoo down here in New Orleans. And I'm tired of being a part of the zoo. Because when you entertain the zoo, you become, become a part of the circus. circus. You know what I'm saying? So this is my other piece. Make sure y'all add this page because they go try to block it out. They go try to knock this page out. I already know. They go try to knock it out. Um, But yeah. That he go talking, talking about he like ghetto. You ain't want to see, but see when the spotlight was on you, you ain't want to talk about it. When you was all hugged up and laying in the bed, kissing and smiling with a nigga, you ain't want to talk about it. You ain't even want to fuck with me. Me and you been cool for years. You ain't want to fuck with me. But see, when, when they put, when they turned and put the spotlight on you, you ain't want to talk. I'm your partner. You got caught down bad. You supposed to come on the show, keep. They got me, bro. They got me. How much I got to give you to grease you to keep you quiet? If I can't afford the grease, fuck it. Throw me up there and then come up there and see what happened and move on. But you ain't do that. You know what I'm saying? You told me you ain't want to discuss it no more, but that's another story. And that's another story for another time. You know, right now we're talking about these green necks and green rings and stuff like that. Um, so let me take this page down because when I um when I um just now when I got off live, um you know the um there's this burn page. Um I'm not gonna get to talk say this burn page's name. Um this burn page loves to be seen, you know, and um ain't into giving this burn page no clout. Ain't into giving this burn page no clout, you know what I'm saying? So um, I'm gonna let y'all know what's going on. You know, um, uh, unique rich buns can't follow me, my girl. You know I don't like you because you be over there, and I think I saw you talking to me, talking about me over there with the people that's infested with the mosquitoes in their blood. So that's why I blocked you. But I see now you're able to get through because this is a new page. And I, I didn't get around to blocking everybody I had blocked previously. You know what I'm saying? But, um, you know, if there's no bad blood, there's no bad blood here. You know, because, um, you know, you know, hating, hating hoes ain't happy. And happy hoes ain't hating. And I'm happy, so I ain't hating or whatever. But if you don't like me, why come over here? You get it? But I mean, I'm cool with it. You know, if you over here, I ain't got no problem with it. You know what I'm saying? I know you likes to drag. And I mean, why not drag for Keith if you can? If Keith fuck up, why not drag for him? You know, he is one of the hottest niggas going right now. So why not tear him down? You know, that's why we all crabs in a bucket in New Orleans. I ain't doing no tripping. I get it. I understand. You know, that's why we all crabs in a bucket in New Orleans. Because they hate to see the next nigga. They go support you until they feel like, not know for a fact, they go support you until they feel feel like you done made a dollar more than them and then you're the worst person in America. They go drag for you. They go make up all kind of stuff about you and this and that, this and that. They go give it to people who you know you don't like and this and that. Then it just becomes a big problem. But I'm not like that. You know what I'm saying? I go to God. I pray. I go to church on Sundays by myself. You know? So um, welcome back, Rich Buns. You know, welcome back. Um, I didn't get around to blocking you again, but um. No problem, fat. No bad blood this way. Um, yay, you know. Um, so let's move on right along, you know, because I ain't hating on no 
not not calling her a bitch, but I ain't hating on no bitch and I ain't hating on no nigga. I congratulate everybody. I ain't gonna lie, I fuck with everybody. I congratulate everybody. White, black, green, or purple, if you're doing something good, you're doing something productive, if you're doing something and illegal, but you making it work for you and putting it to where it need to be, I respect you. I love everybody. I ain't gonna lie. Niggas, bitches, nigga bitches, bitch niggas, whatever. I love everybody. I think that's why I'm so blessed. Boy, let's move right along. Ain't worried about it. Oh, you you need to try to come up here and talk. I get it. I'm an edge of fat, but let's get this straight. Let's get this fake shit straight first. So when I got off the live just now, um, I had um a few receipts that came through uh, from um from my production team. Um, my production team sent me over this. Um, so there's this blog. You know, please don't mention this blog on here. If you mention, let me get a, a moderator in here. Because if you mention the blog in here, you got to know. You go get escorted up out of here by security. Ain't discussing no burn pages. If you're a burn page, Keith was saying he was, and I say he is. Oh yes, Lord, Kelly Vince. I know you love me. I ain't worried about that, Kelly. Shout out to Kelly Vince. We about to have a big old party going up. What's up? I ain't lying. Tomorrow R&B night, I'm going to slide. Listen, I see G Willie in here. I see Papa in here. I see Herb in here. I'm saying this, and I'm saying what I'm saying. We all coming up Empire tomorrow. They got a pool of empire. Genuine get on that stage and do any wrong moves. Slide, smile, whatever he do, I'm throwing him in the pool. You got to know that. I'm going to have to take my lick. My friends go be there. Friends, take my credit card. Come get me out of jail because the bitch got to go swimming. I don't want to see this 85-year-old man dancing on stage talking about in them jeans. Him, his jeans, and his pony is going in the water. I'm just saying, that's what I'm saying. I'm doing it. I'm wearing shorts tomorrow, swim shorts. Wearing my M-line. Going to get an M-line outfit tomorrow. Going with my M-line swimming trunk. So if I go in the water with them, it's going to dry off fast. Got to know that. And that's just the end of that. Thursday, I'm over there at the Woodman Cafe karaoke night. Ooh, Lord, with them steaks. Oh, Lord. <sighs> I'm on a diet. I ain't going to lie. I'm on a diet. That Woodman Cafe is a dirty bitch. They got some steaks over there. I ain't never tasted a sweet steak. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. <sighs> they got karaoke night at the Woodman Cafe on Thursdays. Oh, Lord. That steak at the steak night at the Woodman Cafe will make you step on a dead, on a, on a, a nigga with no teeth dead daddy. Them steaks at the Woodman Cafe. So good. Oh, yeah, it's arena and a seafood potato. They'll make you slap a nigga missing 15 teeth, dead daddy. I'm telling you. Oh, Lord. All right, Brittany. I see you here. Brittany going to be in there tomorrow. Bottle girls, they don't play Empire. Them girls' pussies be shaved. Oh, Lord. Them girls' pussies be shaved. They pretty. Their skin be pretty. They have one of their bathing suits and all that. It's a nice vibe, y'all. Tomorrow we at the R and B night with the genuine, and I'm gonna be genuine. Where we met at? Oh Lord, that's my blood cousin said that. That's my blood cousin, Lord. I ain't gonna read it. Woodmere Cafe is on the West Bank. I ain't gonna lie, cause on my mama, cause man, that steak so good. Oh Lord, I ain't lying. Go over there, cause I'm telling you, Woodmere Cafe. I'm gonna I'm tag them for you. Thursday steak night. But anyway. So, when the live went off, all right, weed, what's going on? They be waxed. Oh, yes, Lord. We there. You don't see no hair. Them pussies got to be bald up in there. It's either the pussies is bald or they got a fade on them. I'm telling you. The pussies has got to be bald or they got Hey, look at my daughter, Debbie. What's going on, daughter? I saw my daughter um, clapping through the um, the all-white party um, Saturday at the Empire. But, but your man was in there. I ain't going to say his name, but T was in there. T would have broke your job, bitch, if you would have done anything wrong. Look at my daughter. Yes, indeed. But anyway, so when I got off live just now, um, I got a few receipts across the desk. You know, they got this burn page. Don't mention the burn page because I don't like them people. I don't know who them people is. And it's, they got to be a sad bitch to come sit on here on a real page and then screen record me and then log out their real page, log into a burn page to go drag for people. People are weird. That is weird. Weird people need to die. 
I ain't gonna lie, we're, we're people need to die, period. So anyway, so the blogs, the blogs, they uploaded this picture right here, trying to be messy. See, the difference between me and those people, those people trying to be messy. I ain't being messy. I'm telling the truth. Now, to some people, the truth may be messy. To others, the truth is the truth. It is what it is. It's the truth. If the truth is messy, it's the motherfucking truth. You got the respect, it's the truth. Now, if it come off messy, or if you think it's messy, look at you bitches, it's weird too. The truth is the truth. The truth ain't messy. The truth is a fact, and that's on that. And I'm for the truth, period. So, like I was saying, the burn page came on and, and then uploaded this about these people right here being messy. The burn page. Listen. Trelly looked stunning Saturday. Dom looked stunning Saturday. Coincidentally, they both had on similar outfits. Coincidentally, they both had on similar shoes. Coincidentally, both of them had the same color hair, but they both were beautiful. I mean, coincidentally, they both had on red lipstick, but they both were stunning. They both were beautiful. And you got to respect that. But you know, bitches hating, mad bitches, oh girl, y'all just got to stop. Hating bitches ain't happy, and happy bitches ain't hating, and a lot of bitches and niggas is clout chasing. And for you to go on your heap of page, snapshot it, and upload it, and all that is a fake and phony. It is what the fuck it is, them girls was beautiful. Um, uh, 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 Trelly and all her friends looked beautiful. Dime and all her friends looked beautiful. Dime and her nigga was color coordinated, looking good. And that's on that. Y'all got to stop with all that. Lord. Oh, Lord. You bitches will never know. Then look at then they got this. CEO Bo purchased that watch for Trelly. Ain't true. False. Rumor. But he go with Dom. Oh, Lord. Now, what this got to do with it? If Bo did have bought the watch for Trelly, what him going with somebody got to do with it? You bitches are weird. Y'all are weird. But guess what? One day, y'all will be so happy and nervous to put mess out there, and y'all will slip up and get caught. And I pray to God that one of these people with money get you bitches' forehead pushed off. That's sad. It's time for y'all foreheads to get pushed off. It's, it's, it's time. It's, you know, it's time for a bitch to meet their maker. You know, you bitches is on here with all that looking for mess. Let the mess go. We got enough mess going on in New Orleans. We got enough murders going on in New Orleans. Let's discuss the truth. The truth ain't messy. Let's discuss the truth. So I'm guessing now they're trying to insinuate that um, um, Bo messed with Trelly. Listen, I know Bo personally. I know Dom personally. And I know Trelly personally. Them people ain't got nothing going on. Y'all got to stop with all the late. Y'all got to stop. Trelly got niggas. Trelly got sponsors. And Trelly got a job. Period. Y'all got to stop with all of that. And that's on that. But anyway, moving right on. Let me add people who have something to say. So somebody just texted me and said, Keith, is it true that all the boys in the night ward had on Rolexes? Bitch, I just told you. The ones I saw Rolexes on, I say their names. They had red faces and they, they had on Rolex and they say that the, a Rolex watch don't click, it glide. I saw them boys had on Rolexes. I don't know if a Rolex, a real one from a fake one, because at the end of the day, I can't afford one. But I just can't see nobody in their right mind paying 20000 for a Rolex. And, here, let me shut up. And I can't see nobody paying $1,000 for a fake watch. We could go pay 700 for a real Apple Watch 10 series. What is you saying? People, it's crazy. But he go why? Y'all know Phil, nine one representer, my fucking brother. He gonna come up here and say what the fuck he gotta say. Now when he on here, y'all ask him. Y'all say y'all can ask him. I'm gonna make sure that y'all don't get y'all fall heads pushed off. Don't go logging out y'all real pages and going on y'all burn pages and start saying silly stuff. Cause then I'm gonna have to get y'all off of here. 
I'm gonna have to get security to exit you up out of here. You see what I'm saying? So y'all come on here and see what the fuck y'all gotta see. Ask the man if it's watch speak. I don't know the real from the fake, to be honest. What they want to know? So they try. They asking is if they asking they asking if you and your partners that got the Rolexes on is they fake. What a lie that cut. I, I, my watch me on my wrist every day. Come here, I got you. Come on, this bitch like a regular, like a regular uh Apple Watch. I, this is what I use like an Apple Watch. What I like. Yeah. Wait, so you use a Rolex as an Apple Watch? Yeah, it's, a, it's the same watch I showed you. Keep it. I wear this bitch every day. I got two of them bitches. That was the one you had on Sunday. The one you had on Sunday had a red face on it. No, this, my I don't have no red face. Sunday, the one you had on, they had looked like diamonds or something on it. Nah, this this one, Keith. All right, let me see. Is it? Is I'm about to get close for you. Let, 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 let them see the light, Perry. Put the light on it so I can sure switch the camera right. so they can see that bitch whining. Look at the ohm. You see the ohm? It don't tick. It says whining. It's whining. So the bitch lying yeah. and dying. I see it. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Yeah. My magnified numbers, they regular numbers. They ain't too big or nothing. They, they regular numbers. Right. You feel what I'm saying? So, so that's, the key notes, that's the key notes to knowing if a nigga watch fake or not. Yeah. It's it's a lot of a lot of shit you gotta know. You did, but like I told you, if you ain't got that card, you, really, if you ain't got the receipt, I fuck the card, card. Cause niggas get cards with fake watches, man. They get cards with the fake watches too. So that shit could be fake too with the code. Like nigga got the receipt to this fucking watch. Like that's another thing. You feel what I'm saying? My watch, look, hold on. Like I showed my card in my pocket, my wallet, bro. Hold on, bro. Yeah, I I, I know. I'll, I'll, I I hope y'all don't think I'm doing too much, but I'm oh, just no, doing it. We gotta we you gotta know? set the record straight because we also need to know a lot of these niggas that be around you two got on these 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 chains oh, and shit God. with the nine on it with the diamonds and all that. Is it real or is it fake? We got to know what's going on. The people Listen, won't key. know. Look, y'all walk around got people scared to ask y'all something, but I say these these good niggas. Now they probably beefing, they probably doing all kind of shit, but around me they good niggas. Listen, Key, if a nigga around me, he ain't got no fake Jews on, bro. All right. He ain't got no fake Jews on. You right. hear me? That I know of. You feel what I'm saying? So listen, so, <laughs> so, and I'm going I'm to keep 100. So what I be overstepping my boundaries if I say Sunday when we go to the hookah during Sunday night, if I have a diamond tester and I test niggas' diamonds. Look, it's so gangster. Fuck what you talking about. This bitch gonna be in effect. This bitch gonna be in effect, and this bitch, you, this bitch talk to you. This bitch don't say nothing about it. Don't ring the lights. This bitch gonna let you know diamond, masonet, pyramid, metal. Yeah, what else the bitch got on there? And, and South by well, how the fuck you pronounce that? You see that bitch light up. If you can look close, you can see the words outside the light. All right. So what side batteries it takes? I'm gonna make sure we got good batteries. I'm gonna let you hear this bitch when this bitch come. No, it's just a, it's, it's, it's a charger. All I gotta do is put it back on the charger. All right, I'll, but make sure if you test something now, make sure if you tell your partners if they jury fake. Hey, that bitch is still ready. Listen, listen. Give me something to put this a key or something. Listen to this bitch. Hmm. You heard it? Oh, yeah, she talking. I heard it. Look. Test something for me. Put that bitch up against a diamond for me. We don't have no diamonds out. Oh, all right, we do. Here we go. Here we go. No, we, got no see, we got it. We got it. Look right here, bitch. Let us see what the fuck going on. <laughs> Let us look. You saw it, huh? Look, this is my car's chain. This is S. All right. Let me see. You heard it? It's so green when it's diamond. Hold on, bro. I got to put these bitches on there. Yeah, put it on there. All right, there go the green. All right. You see that diamonds? I see. This is on the, this is the S. I, I, I'm looking for the, you know. Well, I ain't gonna oh. lie. No cap, I ain't gonna lie. Small as that S is, it better be real. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> because it got to be an S for that small ass S. <laughs> it don't matter if that bitch little or big. Just that know them real. real you know? <laughs> That bitch real. real. He can go yeah. jump in the pool with that bitch on, huh? You, you already know. That's what you heard. You seen one of them earlier said, run these bitches up under the water. Listen, I ain't going to speak on some shit, but we ran these bitches up under the water. Up under alcohol. You heard me a little while back. 
go get some right. water. A lot of motherfucking shit didn't come back, man. I heard that. Hey, look at look at Keith. This toy right here, bro. What's going on, Keith? No, no. You got a few Rolexes and you got a few Rolexes too. What's going on? Maybe right here, bro. Y'all know one thing. If, if anybody know about a Rolex, I know. I have sold lots of them. Lots of them. Okay. So look, he That's got a, a card for his. That's number. real, right? Yeah, uh -huh. it's a serial number and everything. Uh-huh. The so model. A Rolex, a Rolex come with a serial number? Yeah. yeah you think what? Right? Come well, on, man. I don't have one. I ain't think. Oh, I don't have one. You right. You right. My yeah, bad. Look. Right, tell her warranty. Yeah, she know. And oh, Alba, you fuck, 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 I have plenty more for them to buy. You got 41. You, you can also open up the watches and get what? You can, also you can what? open it up and get the number. It's the real number. The numbers on the back. You can, it, it ain't nothing. They can Google it. Right. That's going to let you know right there. Once they Google the number, that, that watch I just told you. It's going to so, say you're the owner, the owner the purchase and everything else. Yeah, and wow. my bad, bad, keep my bad, hold on, keep hold on, bro, my bad. She right, though. She told you something just right, bro. You see that, huh? That's when I bought this bitch. What? That's my last name. You hear me? Right. You know, if a nigga out there, you know, I'm just saying, my watch and my nigga, I don't know about other niggas shit or whatever, other people shit or whatever. You know what I'm saying? So, 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 so don't forget the diamond tester on this, this upcoming Sunday, bro. We need that. Right. That's all we got to know. That's all we got to know. We ready. Have any, have any What's up, Amber? Tomorrow, What's going on? Having your fucking pocket tomorrow. I'm I ain't gonna lie. I got. I ain't gonna lie. My earrings be real. I ain't gonna lie, but I ain't got all the other stuff. I ain't. I don't got it. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't fake like that. I ain't got it. I ain't got no chain. I ain't got no diamond watch and all that. But I ain't got it. I'm over too. But you ain't tired. I'm tired of them getting on the social media with all that stunting, bro. I'm tired of all that. I'm over. It's time to call a spade a spade. What you say? Right. I just think people should let people live their life and do what they want to do with their money. Yeah, but why Why go and pay a yeah, thousand dollars? Well, you know what? I really need to know. Why people worry about other people's lives so much? Why they worry about who, who bought Charlie Watch? Did they buy? Could they afford to buy? Listen, niggas wasn't talk. Niggas or bitches wasn't talking about Rolexes until Charlie got hers. I don't get what's going on. Charlie, a pretty girl. She young. She out here. She getting her coins. Live your life, Charlie. And keep your men secrets. That's the best way to be in life. Yeah, you're right. You're mm -hmm. right. Because them hoes be hungry, Keith, because them hoes be all in DDM. I just read a million DM. He don't give no time for the D. Oh, because Derek know one thing. You crazy. I grew up with him, nigga, have him. I grew up with Derek. I know one thing. He a, he a good nigga. You got your good one, Am. So you popping out tomorrow, Am? Yes, Lord, I'm free. And my birthday coming up too, so I'm starting it off tomorrow. Pop out then. Fuck. I'm Pop cutting up. We cutting up tomorrow. Pop out. All right, Em. Oh, yes, Lord. Em popping out. So the night walk came on this bitch and show. They had a little bit of S. It was real. So we know one, at least, we know at least for sure that one nigga out the hood in the city got a real rollie. We see what the fuck going on. These niggas out here really hustling, doing what they got to do, and, and doing what the fuck they got to do. Cajun. Right, right. We see what the fuck going on. Niggas got Rolexes. 
me see what the fuck going on. I, mean, I see a lot of people on here that I need to discuss. Now they got a few in the night wall, niggas, and they got a few bitches in the summer wall. They got a lot of stuff going on. And my cash app ain't ring yet. And, and I would hate to have to go with the move, you know. So listen, you got to know tomorrow or on night then thursday i got karaoke at the woman cafe and i gotta go to handsome willis you know handsome willis is back open right there off of, uh two lane right there by the bridge right there handsome willis open it's a vibe me and papa there on thursday nights early thursday night i be at the woman cafe getting a bag trying to save to get me a rolex and trying to get me some real diamonds and all that um but i got to give y'all a lie because i got the we got to discuss it. if I don't get greased I gotta see what's going on on top of that we got to find out if the guy who they sent me who pitch I showed if he really bought this Rolex for Trelly Trelly said her sisters put together and bought her the Rolex I'ma keep it a hundred not saying they broke not saying they ain't got it but I know Trelly don't ask her sisters for nothing. So I don't think her sisters bought it. So she's trying to take the heat off of somebody. You see what I'm saying? So we gonna have to um come to grounds. You know what I'm saying? We're gonna have to discuss this and bring this to the forefront. We got somebody else with the name while trying to come up here. Now see, I know his whole mouth got diamonds in it. God forbid that them fake. Because if you got fake diamonds in your mouth, that gums is going to turn green and that's over for you. What's up, son? All right. I I'll know. fuck with you, son. You know that. You Listen. Know that? Is that the... I'll fuck with you the long way. You know that. What BBBS mean? BBS mean go diamonds? BBS. Uh -huh. that's, huh? that's diamonds, huh? Your teeth. What your teeth is? What, in my mouth? You talking about in my mouth? Yeah. Yeah, they ain't gonna ask you no dumb shit like that in my mouth, Keith. They ain't gonna, they ain't gonna... <laughs> I know this. So look, brother. You hear me, son? What? You hear me? But look, I'm my, I still got, you know, why? Well, you know, I didn't did so much dumb shit on social media. I don't even got that to do no more, dog. I'm well proven, dog. You hear me? They know well, listen, listen. Up. You all, you all. Everybody know. I'm well proven, son. Listen, and I know, listen, you're a heavy nigga, and I'm going to be on your heavy nigga. I know that. But listen, you done came across the desk. I'm, listen, I'm just saying now. I ain't going with the, listen, listen, I ain't going with the move right now. I hey, ain't listen, going with the move right listen, now. Listen, check this out, though. Listen, look, we can't, I ain't running about allegations and all that, but listen, check this out, son. I fuck with you, son. You already know what it is. You know what's up, son. I do. Listen. But we got to be fair. Nigga, you a fair nigga. You an honest nigga. Right. You know how this shit go. You done came across the desk. So it's either <laughs> we get, it's either the grease dog Berlin or I got to go with the move. Because it's the people of the of the city sending this shit to me. So that means you've been quiet for too long, people in your fucking business. They're asking me questions about what's going on, what happened in Texas. It's, it's a lot they're asking me. So to cut Man, that down, listen, listen. If he did to go grease me, we got to go. Listen, <laughs> listen bro. They, I, I don't know. Listen, I don't. People just be boring, I guess. But see, I really don't give a fuck about what come. Like I really, all right. Look, check this out. I'm about to get off here with this. Keith, check this out. I really don't give a fuck because at the end of the day, I ain't cheating on nobody. Like you know what I'm saying? Like I ain't got nobody. I'm not making nobody look bad out here. I'm not embarrassing no woman like I probably have did in the past or anything like that. I'm, I don't got to, I'm not doing none of that. All, any female could go to sleep good at night knowing one thing, well, Dean ain't cheating on me. I'm not cheating on nobody. I'm a very, 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 very single man. So at the end of the day, I really don't give a fuck. But, you know, at the same time, they got to stop with all that game. No, 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 they ain't got to stop. They ain't got to stop. But I don't it, really it, give a fuck. But you I'm know, a talk people, but look, a female, you, you been messing with bitches long enough. Females think like this. My way or the highway. You got to know that. 
<laughs> so listen, you got to know this. Because you respect, respect the business that I got going on. And you know what the fuck it is. I got a, they got a few allegations. I ain't gonna lie. They got a, got a, they got a, about a good nine for the for the a nine for the nine. I ain't gonna lie. Man, they no, got, they about like, a good nine stories out here. They're looking for answers, bro. Listen, like I said, bro. See what I'm saying? Look at the girl. One girl right there. Look at she saying, "Yes, we do, Keith." See what I'm saying? The girls feel like it's their way or the highway. Is then that's it? You know how people don't think. What her name is? I ain't saying all that. It's in the comments. Read the comments. But what I'm Man, saying is, I'm like, check this out. Look, check this out. I'm gonna just go ahead on and get off here. But look, Keith, dog, I ain't embarrassing nobody. So at the end of the day, bro, you know, I ain't embarrassing nobody. But I don't feel like the females <laughs> embarrass you. I just feel like you're not doing what they what you oh, want. Ain't no female can embarrass me either, though. That's the good thing. Like I'm just like I'm not embarrassing nobody out here. Ain't no. But it ain't. It ain't me. about embarrassing. It ain't about embarrassing. It's about. People knowing your fucking business. You don't want your yeah, business. Yeah, see, that's the bad part, bro. That right, that's mean, the right thing. Right, so that's the part right there. We got the grease to stop that part. <laughs> All right, sir. All right. All right. All right. Yay. Please know the definition of grease. is either you grease to stop and decease, or you don't grease, and we slide it like grease. You got to know that. You got to know that. I ain't going to lie. It ain't going to change nothing the way I look at you. I still fuck with you 100 plus 9. But the people of the city won't know. And I ain't going to lie. I work for the people of the city. I work for the people of the city. I work for the people of the city. You know what I'm saying? Listen, y'all think it's fake. When y'all go to the hookah drink Sunday, or when y'all see Ryan tomorrow, Ryan, my blood cousin, Literally, my blood cousin Ryan will tell you. I called him. Look, this is what I'm hearing. What's going on? Ryan be like, roll with it, cause I ain't got nothing to hide. I ain't fucking around like that. He love his old lady, he see. So he fucking with his old lady. He don't give a fuck with a bitch. I just say, bring that bitch. See, niggas like that, they really walk in the straight line. But cousins, family, my friends will tell you. Nobody is off limits. We got to get New Orleans great again. We got to make New Orleans great again. They got too many niggas, fake, broke-ass niggas, riding around in bitches' cars, Lil Jodies and all that. Get the fuck up out of here. Bitches is out here faking, phony. it. Look, I'm tired. Oh, Lord. I ain't going to lie. I'm tired of all that. Niggas just want, we just want to, we just want to make New Orleans great again. We want the real to be real. We want the fake to be exposed. That's it. That's it. See, I love people. And I, lo I love whoever. I don't give a fuck. See, niggas got complexes. And certain bitches got complexes. Bitch, I love everybody. I love everybody. That's why I can get along with everybody. I can live anywhere and I can talk to anybody. I love people. You get it? I love people. So I, and, and, and I know if I fuck up, they go bring it. Oh Lord, please! They go wrestle the internet down to the ground. They catch me down, man. That's why I ain't doing nothing. You get it? Duh. It's common sense. I know them bitches waiting to get me to wrestle me to the ground. I ain't gonna look at the other day. I was in Family Dollar and took a piece, took a pack of gum. I ain't paid for it. Once they go break a hundred around a bill for one pack of gum. Walked out with the gum, praying to God that Lord had mercy. Nobody saw me do that. I did it though. I'm real. I'm telling you, I did it. It ain't that I didn't have the money. It's just that I had a hundred dollar bill and I wasn't breaking for a pack of gum. Period. That's all that. That's all that. I don't. That's all. That's just how I went. It is what it is. Lord have mercy. If the family dollar people on here, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That's just what I had to go with the move. Lord, I was shaking like a leaf walking from the to, from the front door of the store to the car. I ain't gonna lie. I was shaking like a leaf. Lord have mercy. I was so scared. Lord, I ain't gonna lie. I was so scared, but I did it. I ain't gonna lie, I did it. And see, these days the time, it ain't no walking no story. They don't know who Key Carr is. Bitch, I did it. I ain't gonna lie, I did it. I'm sorry, Lord have mercy. I swear to God, I'm sorry. That's why I went to church Sunday. Lord, I had to get on my knees and pray. I said, Key, why would you do that? All the good you got going on in your life right now, why I risk it for a pack of gum? Girl, if I would have got caught stealing, that would have been the end of me. They would have wrestled me to the ground underneath the mud. I already know this. I'm sorry. I did it. Oh, I feel terrible. I did it. Oh, Lord. I did it. 
I ain't gonna lie, I did it. Oh, Lord. I did it. I took a pack of gum. Read it on myself, on live. I did it. Girl, I can't go in Family Dollar no more. I'm just going all Dollar General's line. I did it. Because I'm like the man in that was stealing all the detergents. So why is he, if he can get away with all these detergents, why I got to pay for a pack of gum? Fuck all that. Ain't doing it. I said, come, Mr. Family Dollar, bitch. That's what happened. That's what happened. The man was in the Family Dollar stealing all the washing stuff. So why should I have to pay for a pack of gum? And he just stole all the washing stuff. You can't wash your clothes with no gain or no tie because the man just stole it all and ran out the back door with the emergency sound going on. So I really was going to pay for the gum. But when the man ran out the back door with all the detergent and the fire door went off, then we ran behind him. So what I was supposed to stand at the stand at the register with my one pack of gum and wait to give them my money? No, bitch, I left. What's up? I did I left? I'm sorry. That's what I did. I left. I did. I'm sorry. I did. I left. I'm left. I might just go back to the store and give them the motherfucking um uh fifty cent. Cause them the packs of gums ain't thirty five cent them, but they fifty cent now. I did it. I did. I ain't gonna lie. I did. Call me what you want. Call me bro. Call me whatever you want. Good. I did. I ain't gonna lie. I stole it, yo. Oh, Lord. I promise you I did. It was so good, dude. <sighs> it was good. I ain't gonna lie. Because I can't be outside without no gum. No cap. I ain't gonna lie. But let me keep going, bro. Let me add a few people, bro. I ain't gonna lie. I did do it. Oh, Lord. I ain't gonna lie. I did it. I did. I ain't gonna lie. I did, did it. Thank you. What's up, man? At least she had no popcorn ceilings and popcorn walls. I ain't going to lie. Here she go. Here go Tyrell. One thing about Tyrell, she, she's on a production team. She will have tea for you. I know Tyrell will have the tea. <laughs> What you say? I said the one thing about it, I know you will have the tea. You go drop that bitch on the head. What happened? To you? I don't got no tea today. Well, who's them girls eating pussy in the bathroom? I got their pictures. I don't know their names. I don't know. They look like old people. They look like older. My bad, older girls. From the video, you saw that? Yeah, they look like older girls. I got still pictures. I got the pictures in their pictures. Wait, I need. You gotta show us the pictures. I might find them for you. I might find them right now. I don't care who they is. I got their pictures though. I'm, I'm, gonna find them. <laughs> I'm just trying to find out why they eating pussy in the in the zone. That's what I need to find I don't out. Know. Ain't no before this bitch in. No amount of liquor can't make me eat coochie in the stall. I don't know. I ain't gonna lie. Ain't no nigga was in there. It was two bitches licking and eating pussy in the stall. I'm That's telling you. That's what I'm saying. That's trifling. Right. And the one girl. Might, she, they might as well do jump off a bridge too, huh? No, well, one girl was eating pussy, and while she was eating the pussy, she was playing with her pussy. She was patting it or something. Something was on oh, fire. Oh, I ain't even. <laughs> <laughs> she was just sitting on the ground with her legs bust wide open on that pussy. Girl, go look at the video and come back. <laughs> that girl was sitting on the ground eating pussy, patting her pussy. Something was on fire or something. I'm telling what I saw was going on. Something was on fire or something. Here go the video recorder right here. This is the person right here who recorded the video of the pussy, of the pussy eating bandits. Uh-huh. I hope you ain't pissed the shit on yourself trying to get in the stall. And you couldn't get in there because they was in there eating pussy. And this girl is an innocent girl at the John, supporting the John, the white people, trying to use the bathroom. And she couldn't use the bathroom because they had ladies in there eating each other pussy cats and patting pot and patting pussies. You see what I'm saying? Now let me add this girl right here because this is the girl who did the video. She couldn't even get her stuff out her. I don't know if she had to pull pee, but she couldn't do none of none of it. She couldn't do number one or number two. Because they had the nasty hoes in there eating pussy. You know what I'm saying? I hope she ain't messed the bladder up. Because when you hold that piss for too long, the bladder, the bladder, they say, blows up. They say, if you hold the piss too long, the bladder blows up. That's what they told me. I don't know how them pussies work. But they say, if the pussy, if the piss be held in the pussy for too long, the pussy blows up. And I ain't never witnessed the blow up pussy before. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't never saw a piece of blowing up pussy. I'm telling you here now. I'm telling you here first. I ain't never saw a piece of blowing up pussy. It's got to be looking like a piglet when it's finished. I don't know what's going on. It's got to be. But now, what are you saying? I don't know. The, I know the piece. Was the piss blow it up? What happened? <laughs> what happened? Man? I thought it happened. I'm here to. I want to know how you got the pictures. Who sent you the pictures? Who's the who? Who are these? Please, is who? that a question? Girl, please, is that a question? 
Oh, no, but it was a very traumatizing um, right. situation. Me and, you know, my cousin and Warren, we were out having a good time. And, you know, I just wanted to use the bathroom. Right, go, go back. And yeah. I just started hearing moaning and stuff like that. So it was just really like, I was like, is that moaning? Right. Or whatever. <laughs> oh, no. And what happened? And then, like, this had this other girl, she was in there, and then she was like, all right, y'all can, like, hurry up because I need to use the bathroom or whatever like that. And so that's when I just took my phone out because I, I couldn't see what should. was going on. So I had to, like, look so – because I didn't want to, like, just look underneath the stall myself. Right. I didn't want to catch – I didn't want nothing to jump out at me or, yes. you know, any of the fluids or stuff right. 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 to come at me. So I just recorded it from afar, and that's when I seen her, like – you know, shoving her fingers in the girl's, you know, vagina. I saw it. Breath. I saw it. Yes. And then, you know, Calandra, Callie, Callie Vince, you know, she right. went in there at the mix. I told, they didn't want to believe me that, you know, her and, her and Warren didn't want to believe that they had, you know, two girls having sexual intercourse in the stall. Right. And I had to leave because I started catching hives, you know. Did you, did you smell something? I didn't. I, I think Warren smelled something, but I started itching and catching like you know little, little hives and stuff, whatever like that. So it was just very, just very. Un, it, it was very unsanitation. And very unsanitary, yes, because they, Wait, the so girl it's, it's had Warren. All right, because with all that Warren, the Warren ankle swell up. <laughs> so, you know, sometimes Warren... that pussy can't make a seafood make a nigga knees and ankles swell. Warren, Warren actually, okay? Warren actually knew one of the females. Oh no! <laughs> One of the females said, "You know, hey Warren," and Warren eyes just got bugged because he was trying. Like he said so much stuff, and as he, I guess he didn't realize he knew one of the girls. Right. That <laughs> Warren said, basically. Matter of fact, I think I think Warren should get on here. I don't know if yeah, he, I, Warren I, probably I, had his own his own, you know, experience with it. But yeah. yeah, the one of the girls I just saw bare feet on the ground. Oh. And all, yeah, she had her she had her feet on the ground, the bare like barefoot, one was on her knees. It was just trauma. And the moan yeah, oh. the moaning and everything. It was just they just they had a time in that stall. Oh. Until uh Kelly events, yeah, Kelly events um ratted on them and told somebody to get out of the stall. Oh my God! Yes, Warren was very traumatized though too. Though he he thought he said like you know, I could see if it was like bad bitches or anything like that. I mean, if y'all watched the story, the story was very you know funny. Yeah. Um, their pictures. You are, know. You yeah, know, he he thought it was like Shrek and Fiona first. that came outside, and I just can't get that out of my mind. Shrek and Fiona. Sound about right. <laughs> oh yes. Yeah, so yeah. Warren knows one of the girls, though, and I'm just very appalled that he did. I just fell out laughing. I just couldn't understand how the they knew Warren. I, I don't know how. I don't know either of the girls, but I had their pictures. Send this to Warren. Call yes, Warren. yeah. Warren, Warren, are you, Warren knew one of the girls. I don't know if he knew her very well. I don't know if she had anything on, you know, any vagina juice on her mouth, because I think he was about to, I think she was about to probably go in for a kiss, and his eyes got so bucked that, you know, he just couldn't really. Right, monkey pops. Oh, oh, there was black. There was black, Noonie. There was black. Could you? I get, believe there were black. I didn't really want to. I'm a type of person. I don't really want to look too much in the face because I'd be so embarrassed for people. But Warren said it was striking Fiona. I really didn't look too much in their face. The second one I did because Calandra actually had posted one of the girls on her page, so she probably could see that video. I told her, "Don't do that," because you know I'm more. Of, I'm not. You know, I didn't want to like get into anything and stuff. But Calandra actually showed the girl face on her page. I think she might have the video. I don't know. He, uh, Warren said, send him a request. I'm about to send it to him right now. Let me send him to him right now. I hope Warren's all right. Let me send Warren a request. Let me add Warren. I know Warren tried to traumatize. Um, all Warren want to do is teach these kids of New Orleans and sing the yee yee. You know, that's all Warren want to do is sing the yee yee. Do the yee yee dance for everybody in America and teach these kids. And, you know, for him to witness that, you know, you never know if people are allergic to seafood or something. And, you know, for him to have to smell that seafood up in there was terrible. 
and horrific. His ankles and his knees probably swell, poor fella. You know, um, shout out to fucking Warren, man. This is unbelievable. You know, we don't have all that's what y'all get. See, all I love white people, but see, white people freaky. You know, you got to give some white people are freaky. They licking pussy and sucking dick and they eating lick they licking booty hole wherever they got to lick it at. You know what I'm saying? And and, and so so would, would you with the black people doing it in the white people club, it is it, it, like you know, it's like um um butter on a bagel. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, white people eat bagels, so it's butter on a bagel in there. You know, so they they all they for that kind of stuff, you know what I'm saying? But us niggas, you know what I'm saying, we ain't used to that kind of stuff, you know what I'm saying? Even though black people is okay with women eating women pussies, but if a, if, if, if but, but 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 if a nigga was sucking dick in there, it's a problem. I understand that's just how New Orleans is set up, and I get it and I understand. But you know, we was gonna let this pussy on pussy get um just go away like that. We have to discuss this, you know. Um, I had the two ladies on here, you know. Um, you know, I got the um, you know, I got the tread lightly on my social media platform because last time. Um, we discussed a nigga sucking a nigga dick. Um, the police was at my door knocking with a um, stairway order. You know what I'm saying? I to stay away from somebody I don't even know. You know, but um, that's another story for another time. You know, I have my receipts or whatever. Um, but, you know, it was just an allegation. It was brought to me. And, of course, you know, that's what they do. You know, um, they don't get mad at the, the people around them. Um, they don't get mad at the people they keep in their company. They get mad at me, an outsider. You know, I don't hang with you on a daily. I don't even know you. Never hung in your company. Never been at the same place you ever been at, but you get mad with me. And you go to the courthouse, and you won't get me served for papers, and I don't even know you. You see what I'm saying? Um, but, I mean, that's just how the world works, you know. Um, I have my receipts, you know. And, um, um, you know, um, I could have been the dirty, a dirty person and went, um, did a... Um, lawsuit you know um but defamation of character you know um because in the gist it was a lie you know they lied on the gist you know um i don't need a stairway order from somebody i don't even know never hung around um we don't have mutual friends like we have none of that um you know but instead of you know that's just the world we live in people don't get mad at the people around them because let me tell you your biggest hater and your worst enemy is a bitch who or nigga who hang around you you got to know that you see what i'm saying because everybody you hang around not really for you let's talk about that everybody hang around you be around you not for you i hope y'all know that i know that too everybody who be around you hang around you not your friend y'all need to know that but anyway another story for another time so i got to watch what i say and um you know, that's just how, the, that's the way of the world these days, you know. Um, so they don't get mad. He didn't get mad at the people around him that possibly know him. He get mad with me. We ain't never spoke before. We was never friends. We never hung at the same house, never hung around the same people. We have nothing in common, but you get mad with me and get a stairway order put on me for just repeating what was told to me. <sighs> Let's move right along. Because I don't need the police knocking on my door again. I got too much going on. Thank God. Thank God I was blessed. Oh, Lord. Thank God I was blessed to buy a home. To buy me a new home. So I ain't got to worry about nobody knocking on my door or coming serve me Nathaniel. I'm moving and not near bitch. I know where I stay. You got to know that. <sighs> now let's move right along. But yeah, y'all, tomorrow we at the R&B Night with Genuine. Make sure y'all pull up. It's easy if y'all go on Eventbrite and buy y'all ticket and appear at the door, but I know a lot of you bitches is heavy, and I know a lot of you niggas is heavy, and a lot of you broke bitches is fucking with a heavy nigga, so y'all don't worry about paying at the door. I get it, I understand, but see, the empire is something different. You know what I'm saying? It's a, it's, it's a little upscale, you know. I ain't lying. It's upscale, you know. Yes, indeed. So, yeah, I'm adding you. You ain't never come on here. So, let me add um, Unique. You know, they say she, they say, she, well, I'm going to tell her to her face what they say. Hey, Key. Oh, no, Unique. Come on here, girl. Cut the camera on, girl. We can't be fake like this. Girl, got... I'm in a dog. What is you saying? My turn going to sleep. Well, still cut the lights on, Faye. Cut the, I just told you my baby going to sleep. All right, so what's up? 
But I, mean, I just want to be honest, because I'm happy you was being honest and you say you don't like me, because a lot of people, you know, they got to sneak. No, 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 no. I, I said I don't like you because it, you were talking about me. But when I was dragging for you, Key, listen, before you say that, I know the first reason why we, you know why that happened, because Ivy, I was helping up for Ivy. That's why well, that's that why occurred I, last time. I, I ain't gonna be faking makeup nothing. I don't even recall why I had you blocked. I don't know why. But, I know but listen, I never was blocked. Fat. I got three pages. I was always looking at you. Gotta know that. But um, thank you for the support. Yeah, gotta know that. Gotta thank know that. You. But I was helping up for Ivy. You know the situation at the club. I don't want to bring it up. But I was helping up for Ivy. I was, you know. I, I heard about that. I heard about that. I heard about that. Oh. But um. Yeah, that's still fake to me. What on her end? But um, I'm a, I'm a lovable, I'm a likable person. Because at the end of the day, you could, you could, you could at least say, you know what? That bitch keep he real. He 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 fell. But I say that I though, he. I say that. I say I like you all the time, Faye. You got to know that. I say that. But okay, okay. I don't understand why you say you don't like me though. I don't know because I know I had blocked you, but I just didn't remember the reason. So I felt like, well, if I blocked, her, I must not like her. So I just rolled with that story. But to be honest. I'm I don't even know why I don't like you. Why why I didn't like you because I, and I had you blocked and I made sure every time I saw your name somewhere, I made sure I blocked it. But I, at this page, I just didn't do it, I guess, because I don't really care about it all that no more. But, um, you know, we must have had a, a bad... You what? shouldn't care, Key, because we both honest. Whatever I got to say, I'm going to say, you know, I don't have no problem with nobody. If you got to say something, you know, I like that you was honest. I liked it all yeah. that. Like, other bitches not like that, so I get it. You know, it's no beef over here. It's, it's all love, fake. Eh? Thank you. I just wanted to get up here and say that so, you know, nobody don't got to come tell you what right. she, he said. Because, you know, if I could drag right. for somebody, I'm going to say that. But Fat. I didn't drag for you. You know, I be Jostin, but I never drag for you. I'm going to say that. Thank you, Fat. I'm sorry. It was it must have been a misunderstanding. Um, I'm sorry as well. I'm a dope, not going to apologize. So, Thank you. Now, that was big. Um, I liked it, oh, Boy. Oh, I'm going to see you October 7th. You got to know that. You got to know. Let's sing and say the best thing I never did. Whatever she said. <laughs> got to know that. See what I'm saying? Sometimes it's easy to be an adult about a situation because I ain't gonna be lying. I knew I had blocked it. I don't know why I blocked her or whatever. I don't know. And then I'm just saying I don't like the girl. And you know, your mind makes you feel like you don't like somebody. Like if you say you like somebody and you keep saying you don't like somebody, that means you don't then all of a sudden your mind starts believing that you really don't like these people. And I don't know what the girl did. That's crazy, right? But that's what a lot of us do. They say they don't like me and don't have no reason not to like me. Ain't begging or boring. Don't owe nobody nothing. I don't know. That's crazy. That's why a lot of people getting killed out here because they killing and disliking and fighting off of assumptions. The only person I'm happy that got the piss knocked out of him was Hood. Oh, Lord, I was so happy about that. I'm happy that he got 18 teeth knocked out of his mouth. I don't want y'all to forget this right here. So that's before we move on, we got to remember that he got the piss beat out of him today. I don't want y'all to forget that this fella right here got beat up. You know what I'm saying? He got the piss beat out of him today, and all his teeth was knocked out his mouth today. Today, he lost out on um, 17 teeth. 17 teeth was knocked out of his mouth today. Y'all got to remember that. I don't want y'all to forget. Um, he came down here from Texas after being so messy, and he looked like this when he came down here. A little nigga, pussy nigga bitch, a little pussy purple punk, black gums, nasty yellow teeth with a gap in the middle. Um, wearing Wrangler jeans with a um with a, um the City Trends um shirt that was on sale. Um, he wore hush puppies and he came sliding on, with them hush puppies on down in New Orleans. You know what I'm saying? And um, he drags for so many people and he came to New Orleans and thought he was safe. And my nephew Puss Gang found him and he came down here looking like this. And when Puss found him, he was left looking like this. I don't see nothing to smile about. Oh, Lord. It was already ugly. His daddy dead, thank God. His mama ugly with a bad back, thank God. His sister ugly and bald head, oh my God. Him and his mom need to jump off the bridge and meet their daddy. Go live with their dead daddy and a dead husband, please. Oh, Lord. Look at him. Oh, Lord. This is, um, this made me smile today. I ain't gonna lie. This made me very happy. You know, um, he got 17 teeth knocked out of his mouth today. Um, you know, 
um, look at God. You know, won't he do it? You know, um, um, you know, I see um, y'all looking at him and y'all in disbelief. But um, no, he doesn't um, play football for the um, 49ers. I see y'all see the red here with the goal outline. He doesn't play for the 49ers. He's not a cheerleader for the 49ers. He's just stupid. Um, he's stupid. His dad is dead. Um, his mom is dying. Um, his sister ugly. He's just an ugly person. And, um, I'm happy today. He almost got the life beat out of him, you know? Um, so if anybody is around the family dollar city trends area, um, and finds, um, 19 teeth without a mouth, um, this is the owner of the teeth. So you can contact the key carriage to pick up the teeth, put them in a plastic bag, um, with some dumpster juice in it because you got to soak them dumpster teeth for this trash mouth bitch. Um, and contact the Key Carroll Show, and I'll have my management team come meet you and get the um, the, 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 um, the 19 teeth floating in the dumpster juice, um, and we'll get it to the rightful owner. You know what I'm saying? That's what we do over here. Um, he could still use those teeth, you know, um, you know, with his little pissy pussy punk ass. You know, he's a little pissy pussy punk, you know what I'm saying? And um, thank God that, um, you know, I'm happy that um, he was actually caught. Um, shout out to Puss Gang, you know. Um, Puss Gang did an awesome job. He made me smile. You know, um, can the doctor put them back in? No, we don't. You know what? Better yet, if you find the teeth, just throw them far away. Spread them up. Because we don't want him to go back and find all 21 of them teeth. And then he get them put back in or something like that. So if y'all see the 21 teeth by themselves, pick up them, put them all up and just throw two of them. Keep them with you. And as you're riding past the canal or something, just throw them in the water. You know what I'm saying? We don't want him to get those teeth back with his little ugly tail self. You know, um, Shout out to Puss for um, making New Orleans smile again. You know, that's all we need in New Orleans is to smile again. We got to put a stop to these pussy punks. We got to put a stop to these punks. These punks go fall. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's, you know, it's a difference. You know, certain punks like this, the dirty ones, they just go too far. And I'm, I'm happy that this happened. Um, I hope that um, he sees this live and he's um, he gets very upset that he want to kill himself. And I hope that he jumps off the bridge, you know, and um, bring his mom with him, you know, and um, fucking bring the sister with him too, you know, and um, you know, make um, New Orleans smile again, you know. We want to smile. We don't want to look at that anymore, you know. Um, so let me add Warren up here to talk about these ladies who was licking pussies and sucking pussy up in the, the John's bathroom. You know what I'm saying? Um, Let's talk about this. You know, he done played with too many people. Um, kick Gunners out of my project. You know, um, Puss is my nephew. Um, he done played with a lot of people. Um, he just goes far. You know, he does. He goes far. You know, um, you know. so I just hope that um, the whole ugly family jumped in the river and killed himself. Because, you know, the Adams family was years ago. You know, and it um, looks like the Adams family came back in the black skin. You know what I'm saying? So we want the Adams family Frankenstein and all them different people in the Adams family to stay dead. So he needs to go jump in the water. We need to kill this bad grass. You know what I'm saying? Um, so let's just move forward. Let's just add Warren and see what's going on. I know Warren was in a bad situation Sunday at the John. Um, oh, Lord. Um, he, he suffered trauma. Let me add Warren. He go Warren right here. Let me add Warren. I know he suffered trauma um, from seeing all that pussy licking going on. Is y'all right, Warren? Everything okay? How y'all doing? Y'all can hear me? Yeah, Warren, please don't cry. You go make us tear up. Don't cry, you know, Warren. I, I can't really be on here that long because they shoot around my house. I live in the Seven War, first and foremost. You could never live in the Seven War, bitch! They ain't shooting the Seven War. You must be in the Ninth War. But keep...